President Trump seems to have a touch of Lincoln envy. The late, great Abraham Lincoln. Most people don't even know he was a Republican, right? Does anyone know? Uh, yeah. But we didn't know this. President Trump tweeted, Wow, highest poll numbers in the history of the Republican Party. That includes Honest Abe Lincoln and Ronald Reagan. There must be something wrong. Please recheck that poll. Oh, there's something wrong, all right. False on the PolitiFact truthometer. Even Jimmy Kimmel sent someone out to do some research. Lincoln, Lincoln or Trump? Lincoln. Lincoln or Trump? Lincoln. Lincoln or Trump? Better president. Oh, Lincoln. Who's a better president, Lincoln or Trump? Trump. Trump. Perfect. Said the woman in front of the Hooters. There is one itty bitty problem with President Trump comparing his poll numbers to President Lincoln's. Abe Lincoln was dead before polls started, read one exasperated tweet. Lincoln died 71 years before modern scientific polling started in 1936. In Lincoln's time, there would have been only tiny local straw polls. President Trump does have an 87% approval rating among Republicans, but other presidents have topped that. What would Lincoln say? Conan once juxtaposed animatronic Abe with the real Donald. I mentioned food stamps, and that guy who's seriously overweight went crazy. He went crazy. Trump actually used Lincoln to score points against Clinton. Okay, honest Abe. Honest Abe never lied. That's the good thing. That's the big difference between Abraham Lincoln and you. That's a big, big difference. We're talking about some difference. Call me crazy, but I don't think Honest Donald is the nickname history will bestow on President Trump. When it comes to stature, even when you're saluting him, Abe seems to turn everyone into the size of one of his shins. Genimo, CNN. Build that wall. Build that wall. New York. Build that wall. 